but you're probably gonna by the time the boss comes out now at this rate. Otherwise, oh, otherwise, I still don't know when the actual bosses do come out. For all I know, they could come out of this round. Ah, let me fix where I'm sitting on my chair. Um, okay, that took a while for them to start spawning. Okay, now one shot takes him down to half health. Still two shot now, though. Wonder when it's going to take three shots to kill him. Okay, that was weird. Ah, fix my headset. There you go. Oh, hello. And I'm not paying attention enough right now. I'm trying to fix my headset. I hate putting my headset on over my ears and having like my edges of my hair going into the air cups tickling my ears. <laughs> it's very annoying sometimes. So I'm always just sitting here putting my finger like in the ear cup of my ear to try and pull my hair out. So I have pretty long hair at the sides, so it always annoys me, tickles my ears. I wish I had a grenade right now. I could use the monkey bomb, but that's just that's just a waste. I do have 850 of that stuff. When I get to a thousand, I could just use the monkey bomb just for fun. Because then I'd be able to afford another one instantly. I do like that this is a small starting area though. Because now I don't have to worry about zombies coming from 20 different angles. We can just only spawn there, there, over there, and I think come from the ground over there. So what, like one, two, three, four. I think they can only spawn from four places, unless I'm mistaken. Maybe they can come over here, I don't know. That goes into there, okay. It's still new and learning this map, though. I do like what they did with this map though, this is the um, inside here is the first ever zombies map that was on World at War. I had so much fun on that map. I'm pretty sure anyone that played that map knows the, like, the little spot where everyone would go. They'd uh, go right at the top by the stairs up there, like the stairs that circled around. Like all four people playing uh, multiplayer would just hold right back at the edge, use LMGs and ray guns and just... Demolish zombies trying to hold up as long as you can against that wall. You know where the um where the grenades were. That was a lot of fun back in the day. And then I think the next the next map that came out was Derise, and then if I'm not mistaken, that's when Perk Machines first came out. Or maybe it was the uh, the swamp map, I'm not sure. I think it might have been the swamp map actually where Perk Machines first came out. I just know even though like back in the day the first ever zombies map that was ever created it was fun, it was just a struggle without perk machines. And then on uh like Black Ops one or Black Ops two I think, they released the same map but had perk machines in there and that was much more fun. Well I mean it was much more fun but it took away some of the nostalgia of just playing without perk machines. So I guess it's give and take with that. Whether you have more fun with perk machines, being able to survive longer, or you can just have the plain nostalgia of just World at War zombies, which was just so fun. Oh, there's a lot of them now. You know what? I'm gonna use this to get the fire out. There we go. I do prefer the special ability with the phase thing rather than the fire. But I forgot to put that on this glass. This is going pretty slow. On round 13, I've already been recording for like 20 minutes. Ow, okay. I don't, I don't like the fog in this game. I hate that it just randomly turns foggy every now and again. I already have bad eyesight as it is. I have cataracts. Not even a joke. I'm 24. I have cataracts in my eyes. 
I had an operation recently, about a month or two ago, in my right eye to have it fixed, and I have to go have my left eye fixed soon. So basically, when it's foggy, this is what I see in real life out of my left eye. <laughs> Even worse than this, actually. Very bad. Like, if I took my glasses off right now and closed my uh, right eye, which is my good eye, this is exactly what I'd see in real life. Like, twice as bad as this. Everything would just be foggy. Like, a, a like if I put my hand in front of my face, I'd be able to see how many fingers someone was holding up. But like, if someone was on the other side of the room, and they only held like two or three fingers up, I'd struggle to tell how many fingers they were holding up. Like, for example, that's how bad it is. It's weird though. I've had the surgery on my right eye, so now my right eye is pretty good and I can see out of it very clearly now. But I can see the uh, fake lens that they've put in my eyeball. I can kind of see it like, like there's like glare, like you know when you hold a camera up to light, you can see the glare from the light. That's what I see. Like if if I look like if I'm standing next to a light bulb, like on the ceiling or on a lamp or something, I can see the glare in the lens in my eye. It's weird. It's not a bother. It's just. It's just weird getting used to it still. Okay, I have C4 and Monkey Bombs, so it's probably the best two things for me right now. I wouldn't mind seeing a Molotov pop up, because Molotovs just demolish zombies. I think Molotovs are actually better than the special ability with the fire. At least that's the, um. That's what it seemed like the one time I've used Molotovs. What was that? We'll take some more of that. How much do I have now? 210? Okay. If I remember quickly, I think it's 250 for the chopper gun, so I'm very close now. Honestly, I didn't think I'd survive this long. I thought I'd survive till like round 15, and I'm on 14 now. But I thought I'd, it'd be much quicker than this. I've been recording for like 23 minutes now. I didn't think it'd take 23 minutes to get to this round. Probably wouldn't usually take 23 minutes to get to this round if I was just playing zombies normally, but since I can't leave this room and I'm only using this shitty shotgun now that takes fucking like five hits to kill them. <laughs> what else do I expect, I guess? Oh, I do see some of that blue stuff dropping, and that's what I need for the chopper gunner. I'm just taking these zombies over here. Wait, how much do I still have? 1,300. Yeah, I can use a monkey. There we go. Grab that. I'm now 220. Wait for it. Wait for it. Now. <laughs> yes, please. Thank you. 250, okay. 230 right now. Oh, okay. Hello. Come on, is there any more of this stuff? It's kind of hard to see stuff on the ground. It's no, is that a normal frag ray or is it Semtex? Normal frag, I might as well take it. Wait, what is with my 6 button? Is that a Semtex grenade or is that a decoy grenade? It's one of the two. Uh, 2.40, okay. Yep, here's the boss. This is probably the round I die now, round 15. I called it! Okay. Let's try and cook this nade and try and hit the boss with it. Where's the boss? Oh, there he is. Okay, he's doing a lot of damage to him. More damage than I thought. Please don't hit me with that thing. I wouldn't mind if the, the bosses just couldn't throw things. The fact that they can throw projectiles is what makes them so annoying, in my opinion. Well, I just wish they wasn't in the game. Do I even want to turn that guy into a split? Probably not, eh? Because if I do split that boss, then it's just going to be double the difficulty. Probably just want to leave him alone and try not to hit him. How? Could you not, mate? <laughs> okay. Oh, I only have one bullet left. That's no bueno. Oh, he would be right next to the ammo box. 
and I can't just quickly run over to the ammo box. I have to wait here for a few seconds and then just buy it. There we go. You know, I'm going to try and train them around this tank here. I'm going to put the fire down at the edges, like the opening. There we go. Ow! I do still have quick revive, so that's a thing. Or self revive, or whatever it's called. Ooh, hello. Ow! Okay, now I have a chopper gunner. Could you not? Okay, I'm gonna... okay, I didn't even press left trigger then. Don't know why it shot. Come on. There we go. Got a monkey. I'm assuming monkeys don't work on bosses, right? Well, let's find out. Um, no! Ah, oh, okay. Well, didn't mean to do that. I'm on the bright side, I can't die. Holy hell, did I just kill both of them already? Sure, I'll take that. Ammo 40. What? Ammo drops on the ground? Okay. Key card. Picked up key cards before, I still have no clue what they do. I must have enough for another job we're going that's not bad. Is it a kill already dead? Well I think this video is gonna be longer than I thought it was gonna go. I have four Semtexes? The fuck? I thought you could only pick one up at a time of certain things. Well actually no, I, I knew you could pick up two Tomahawks at a time. I did play for a lot of hours though yesterday and never picked up more than one of any certain things. Like one normal frag grenade, one Semtex, one Molotov. I've only used Molotov once. It seems really good. One time I used Molotovs yesterday, it seemed to do more damage than my special ability, which I'm going to use now. Fifteen down? Is that what my guy just said? Did you not? Hmm, what is this thing? I don't know what I just picked up, but okay. Ooh! Okay, hold on a minute. I just swapped out my Semtex as well. I don't want that. Semtex is okay. Holy hell, that kills a lot of zombies. The fuck? Where's that? Well, depending on how long these things stay on the floor for, I might just leave that. And pick it up once I've used all four of my Semtex grenades. At this point, I'm not even really getting many kills with a shotgun, most of it's from everything else. Like my Semtexes, the monkey bombs. Chopper wait, can I buy a chopper gunner? I can buy two monkeys, that's nice. Didn't know I could do that. Okay, they run fast now. Sir, calm down, please. Sir, go home, you're drunk. Ow. I'm gonna wait till I have a load of them, I'm gonna shoot them a few times and hit them with Semtex. I should have done most of them. Holy f Ooh, Okay, that's a lot of them. 
I'm only on around 17. How the hell is there this many zombies? Shoot a few of them. Bring them over here. Run! Ow! Is that an insta kill? It is. Yoink. I'll take that, I don't really need it right now, but I'll still take it. Two sixty, yes, I can buy another chopper gunner now. What? Okay. It was still greyed out, that was weird. That must have been a glitch, a visual glitch. Because it was greyed out like I couldn't buy it for some reason. Hmm. Frag grenade. What is this? Okay, there's more of that stuff. I have 30 now and 20 of these. Do I have 54,000? I do. Yeah, I can't use it on anything. I would like if the uh, the table over here had like... I think the word is equivalent to exchange. Like if you want to buy a chopper gunner it takes 250, the normal 250 it usually takes of that like box stuff. Or like 500 of the other stuff, or like 10,000 actual money. That'd be nice. But instead, it's just one currency for each individual thing, or one of the three different currencies that you can use instead of all three currencies. Hit him with another grenade. Why do they all fall down when they get hit? I mean, I kind of like it. It could actually be a bad thing because they could be on the ground, like knocked over, and you might not be seeing they're actually knocked on the ground and just walk over to them and get stuck. I'm running up the school. Killed a load of them. Holy hell! Okay, yoink, yoink, yoink. There we go. Out. I can pick up. Did you not? What's that? Our system. Okay, um... Wait, come to think of it, how much is... Okay. I'm going to have to bring these guys over because I want to see how much C4 costs. Okay, they're all over here now. Five hundred. Okay, that's not bad. Hog, I kill every single one of them. Probably could have waited a little while longer to pick up that double points. Since it's going to take a few seconds for any zombies to spawn. So it's just going to be wasted time on the double points now. This does no damage at level 19. What? Oh, round 19. Wow, it does like... Not even one sixth of their health. Wow, okay. I'm surprised I made it to level 19 so far, and I'm not gonna lie, I haven't even got downed once, I've still got my self revive. I have 500 of that, I think I can buy another C4 now. I'm gonna go buy another C4. That was weird. I got stuck at the crafting table. I'm gonna bring these guys over here. Put the fire down. All right. Open it up. Lethal. Okay, I can get three at the map for the most, which is 1,500 of that middle stuff. <gasps> Ooh, that was scary. I'm curious to see how much damage the uh, C4 does to the boss. Could be a nice little strat to kill the boss, that could. Fuck 
killed all of them. What? Okay, not all of them. I take it back. I take it back. I'm sorry. Huh. Well, there's another three C four. Even a headshot and does no damage. Okay. Semtex, I'll pick that up now. Two of them, it's not bad. Hey, buddy. 